And I'm on a mission trying to find some of the weirdest hot dogs across RVA. I don't want anything with just simply ketchup and mustard. I want something crazy. Let's see what I can find. And I'm off on my journey. First place on my list, the Dog Wagon Plus. Dude, what's your craziest uh, hot dog? Craziest or prettiest? Craziest, weirdest. Intimidator. Intimidator. Buffalo, go for it. All right, let me get that. What you're looking at is the Intimidator, a half pound, all Angus made as a buffalo dog. You can make it any way you want with as many toppings, but for me, to make it through the day, I got it buffalo style. Deep fried, topped with buffalo sauce, has ranch on it, and it's topped with crunched potato chips. This gets an A plus in my book. Oh, it's my jam. Making my way in a quarter mile. Keep right to merge onto Puai Parkway. Continuing my journey, we arrive at Hogshead Cafe. What's your weirdest hot dog? That would be our big boner. Let me get that. All right, coming right up. This monster is a half pound beef hot dog wrapped in bacon and deep fried, then topped with pool barbecue, then coleslaw, then, if that's not enough, it's topped with ribs. That's a lot of food. <laughs> oh my. What, what are you taking a bite in? What? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> And my final destination of the day is Bocata Latin Grill. What's the craziest hot dog you have? We have the Perro Caliente Venezolano. Okay, cool. Let me get that. Right, I'll be right up. This Venezuelan hot dog is called Perro Caliente. It's topped with coleslaw, garlic sauce, cilantro, pink sauce, potato sticks, and cheese. Now, of course, I couldn't try all the places in one day, but if you head over to my NBC12 Facebook page, I have a list of places for you to try. On your side, I'm Terrence Dixon.